Come on, son. What is it? This is Chad and Dave. Where are you going, Chaddy? Together, they enjoy coming into London for lunch. That was until last week, when a restaurant refused to let them in. Staff said no dogs allowed. All I wanted to do was do what hundreds of thousands of Londoners do every day, which is to go and enjoy a nice lunch. I couldn't do that, which left me um, feeling uh, rejected, dejected and, and utterly humiliated. It was here on Tottenham Court Road at this branch of Franco Manca where it happened. Dave said he shows staff paperwork which shows the dog is legally allowed to be inside, but they wouldn't listen. Dave works for the guide dogs and has had his own for 40 years. He says he's seen ignorance of the laws about them getting worse and he's had enough. My stance is to, uh, to speak for those who aren't so um, confident and the people who were rejected every day of their, their, their lives um, by people who behave in a discriminatory manner. Hi, hi, hi. Good afternoon, welcome to Em, how are you? Very much, good, thank you. Very good. Today, Dave and Chad have been invited to have lunch in Bank. The owner here says he heard what happened and wanted to make up for it on behalf of the restaurant industry. Brilliant. I think there's a stigma against animals in restaurants. There's no law about dogs not being allowed in restaurants, and that's any dog, let alone an assistance dog. So um, it's quite an odd um, situation that the industry is so backward in their thinking. Franco Manka has issued an apology and said it was a mistake made by staff here. It's now improving training to stop this from happening in the future. Despite the apology, Dave says he's now considering legal action against the restaurant. He wants the industry to be more welcoming to those with assistance dogs. Victoria Cook, BBC London News.